Hello guys, this is Chaudhary Fahim and you are watching Exceptional Programmers. In this lecture, we will discuss about introduction to database, database management system and importance of database. If you have no idea about database, just relax. The main goal of this course is to start from zero to hero. Thank you for watching this course. In upcoming lectures, we will be cover both common and advanced terms. I promise you it will be amazing. So the first thing you need to know is what is database. An organized collection of information in computerized format. Another definition, a collection of information organized and presented to serve a specific purpose. The purpose of a database is to store data in an organized way, like a telephone book is a common database. By using database, we can insert, delete, retrieve, and update data easily. The database is the collection of data about anything, could be anything like students, movies, personalities, hobbies, countries, and many more, anything about which you want to store. What we mean by data? Simply the facts or figures. What is meant by here organized way and unorganized way arrange your data in a systematic way? An organized collection of books which is stored on shelves in this situation it is easy to find a book but it is difficult to find a book from the unorganized collection of books as a human it is difficult also same case with computers another important thing that you should be very clear about is the difference between a database and the database management system the database management system, also called DBMS, on the other hand, is the software or tool that is used to manage the database. Some tools navigate easy PHP. Database is a collection of data. DBMS is a tool to manage this data and both jointly are called database systems. Importance of database. Why database is so important? Application mainly store the data in the computer storage, then access and present it to the users in different formats, also termed as data processing. For example, banks, shopping, customers, services, and many other applications. Such applications are being managed by databases. Databases are related directly or indirectly almost every person in the society. Finally, we can say that databases are very important. These applications store data for future use database of these applications. Every person in society gets benefits directly or indirectly. Visit us on www.exceptionalprogrammers.com Send us your basic information. Please subscribe our channel on YouTube. Like us on Facebook. See you in next lecture.